Hey there, my name is Alex and I'm a solutions engineer here at Directors. Today, I'm going to take you through a couple of new features in version 10.5. First off, there's been a full release of our new SDK. We've been hard at work building our new SDK and today marks its full release. You can expect proper type safety, modular importable functions, that means you can reduce your overall build size and support for directors real time. Of course, if you don't use TypeScript, then the new SDK works great for you as well. We've built the new SDK in the open and thank you to all of the community members who have helped and provided feedback and participated in the process. Every endpoint has code snippets in our API reference and all guides have been updated in the docs to use the new SDK. Speaking of API reference, an improved Directus API reference. Directus has almost 200 endpoints for working with your data, your files and projects. We have given our API reference some love and introduced a new component that allows you to see the REST, the GraphQL or the SDK examples easily. It remembers your preference so you can always see what's relevant to you. Superbase file storage adapter. Another awesome community contribution, this time from Matt, adds a Superbase storage driver. And this means that you can use Superbase storage while still managing your files through directors. Configuration details can be found in the docs. Awesome community contributions. We also want to thank our community for their contributions towards this release. Thanks to Bevis for working with the team to improve our API reference with the new REST GraphQL toggler, as well as the new SDK snippets. Thanks to Matt for building the Superbase file storage adapter that we spoke about earlier. Thank you to Magnus for fixing a small visual bug on our Kanban layout when displaying formatted values. And thanks to Ashish for fixing a couple of display issues with our insight panels. Finally, thanks to Gerard for a trio of contributions. One that adds support for deep in use items, one that fixes permissions not honoring dynamic values, and one that simplifies some code around flows returning status codes. Directors 10.5 is now available on NPM and Docker Hub and will be available on Directors Cloud early next week. Thanks for joining me and see you in the next release.